hello guys welcome to the channel uh, crypto global hundred okay guys let's get straight to the point today i'm gonna tell you about uh, how the market works okay how the prices work a lot of guys have tm me about the prices of btt bittorrent wink price doggy coin and other altcoins as well so some people say that this price is going to go up or not so i wanted to give you guys some brief introduction is uh, about the market how the market works okay how the price works okay so i'm not that guy that which shows you on the thumbnails that 5x is coming 1000x is coming 100x is coming to the moon or to the mars whatever i don't like the fancy stuff i try to stay realistic okay so this video is about giving you the uh, general prospect of the market how the market works how the price works okay so and after reference reference to the bitcoin price here you can see i'm referring to the btc price okay so uh, after you know going through the btc price we're gonna uh, going to predict the price of bittorrent also we're gonna take a look at wink coin as well as the doogie as well and many other altcoins so here is the thing let's start the video uh, I'm as I told you that guys that I am not a fancy guy I don't like that stuff I try to stay as realistic as possible so let's start the video so here is the thing okay guys this is a BTC chart okay Bitcoin chart okay and I want to let you know guys that how the price works how the levels are retested for the healthy growth you see let me start with the uh, very early thing you see here the price started from 4485 back in 17th of august okay the price went down here you see here 3400 okay this was the first time it went low to 3400 okay just uh, take the notes or whatever just listen to me okay just listen to me what happened here the price went down okay it was the first time this level was tested making it a sport zone okay it this became a sport zone now what happened next the price came up consolidated and it went up and making new high okay this was the new high for the BTC back uh, back in 17th of september okay you can see here it was near around 4009 839 what happened after that the price came down and tried to break this level you can see this you can't you know specifically uh, target any zone you you can say this is a zone this zone was tested okay it was rejected from here and again the price went up and it tested this zone this zone okay this zone was tested and in the downside this zone was tested second time first time it was rejected second time it was rejected again okay the price came above and it was first test here second test here rejected again okay again the price went down making a new low making a new low breaking that uh, sport okay but due to the volume it was a fake uh, breakdown and price went up and consolidated and again it was rejected from this level and the price went up up uh, consolidation phase was going on okay you see and then after that when the price broke through this level this zone okay this zone when it broke through making a new high here it made a new high 5900 okay it was the new high okay what happened of that after making a new high this level this level became the sport zone okay and this level became the resistance how because the price went down it was rejected from this level and making it confirmation it it was a confirmation that this level is now a sport level because it was rejected from this level this was good for the price to move up what happened after that the price went up okay making a new high here so let's draw a new high here as well 
see here now a new high was made again the price went down because it was a new high the price went down to here okay making this you see this it touched the lower part of the swing low making a new support it was a it was a zone inside this zone okay this was the bigger zone but making it a fractal we can say that this was a fractal fractal sport i'm gonna give you uh, some topics some uh, introduction about the fractal sport zone you can also google it on the you can also google and search for it okay so this was the lower swing low of the btc okay and this became the fractal sport it was tested okay this zone was tested and uh, the price went up remain in the consolidation phase then again you see here it broke through it broke through this resistance level this was the resistance level you can see this zone remained for 17 14th of october to 30th of october you know for 15 days the price remained in this zone when it uh, broke through this level it made a new high you see here now it had made a new high of 7480 you can see here okay see here it made a it made a new high here okay it made a new high now what it is that this level was never tested this level was never tested you can see on the downside not on the upper side but on the downside it was due that this level had to be retested for the healthy price to go up got my point i'm making you guys to let you know about the other altcoins how the market works okay now the price came down price came down and again retested this zone fractal zone fractal support okay this zone this level was retested so it so it is a healthy growth that the price was retested you know price had to be retested and rejected you see here it was rejected you see here it was rejected making it a strong sport zone so after that the price went up okay breaking through this new zone you see uh, let me zoom in here this was the uh, resistance zone here this was a resistance zone okay the price came back here touching the sport zone here fractal sport zone and then it broke through when it broke through we had a new high we had a new high okay you see here 17 7940 this was the new high okay this was a new high and you see right after that the new high was rejected and this which, which was previously the resistance it became the support level see here let me show you here if we go in detail this was the resistance zone okay when it broke through price went up making new high and this which was previously a resistance now became the sport because it was rejected twice okay you see here now after that the price went up making again new high okay and the price which was let me show you again let me zoom in this was which was resistance after making new high here you see this resistance became sport zone and it consolidated in this in this period okay but the thing is i want to tell you guys that whenever level was broken it was retested level broken this level broken let me start let me show you from here this level broken retested 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 here this level broken retested okay but here this level you know this level on the downside was never tested so it was due in the you know in the coming years or days you see here this level has not been retested it was due because it was a bullish move okay it was a bullish move ahead so this level was never tested but in the future this level is going to be retested so let me show you again again this level broken it was retested good that was a healthy move now after that the price went up making new high here 
okay making a new higher of 19,939 okay it made a new high it made a new high and which was previously a new swing high which was resistance it now became the support because it was rejected from this level and these two candles in two days showed that the bulls and the bears both were in control there was an indecision in the market whether to go down or whether to go up but due to the large volume the price went up breaking through this level of resistance and the price go up it it increased now this level was not tested this level was not tested this level was not tested and the price is going up and up okay got my point now again if we go up the price went up and up and up and making new high till here okay here now the price made a new high here which was at 16053 okay the price went up and making a new high what happened after that two days of consolidation or you can say a retest of this and bullish engulfing candle it made a new sport zone here that this became the new sport zone here at you can call this as a sport zone here 12,000 became the new sport zone it was retested now this level not tested this level remain untested this level remain untested this level remain untested see it never came back it never came back it never came back here it never came back here it never came back here so these three zones were due because these levels were not retested so what happened but but this level was tested it was good for healthy you know healthy price growth what happened after that the price went up breaking this resistance again tried to break but went down because the there was a good selling good strong sell was on but here what happened the price here was rejected by the downward you can see the swing body of the swing low you see it was rejected from this level making it a good supply a good demand zone it became a good demand zone, which i showed you here maybe somewhere here that when the price came back it touched the lower of the uh, body <coughs> sorry so what happened there after that this level became the new sport zone okay this because this level was tested it went up making a new high then making a new swing high uh, swing low high you can high low you, you can call this this became the new sport making it it tried to break you can see how many times it was rejected one two three four five six six times it was rejected okay so making a level weaker whenever a level is tested multiple times multiple times then this level or that level becomes weaker and that that happened here making this level weaker and also making high lows this was like you can call that it was a bullish pennant okay it broke through it broke through it went up making a new high and bitcoin was at the strongest we can call that it was at 19,539 so this was the largest okay this was the highest point of the BTC now what happens after that we made a new high I am also reference referring it to BTT big torrent so I want to let you know go guys how the market works okay you see here this is the BTT chart as well let me show you guys here you can also see that this level has never tested this level has never tested and uh, this level has never tested okay so i want to give you the details about how you can see here it's it's very correlated to BitTorrent as well okay let me show you here okay what happened after that let me go move on the next candle what happened the price rejected from this level after that it again rejected and this candle was a <coughs> doji candle 
you can say there was good sell off good uh, buying zone as well again next candle it went down a strong supply zone a strong supply zone means sellers are very you know they were willing to sell from this high and they don't want the price to move up now you can see the wicks below you can see here the wicks directions are now in the downside this week was the first attempt to break this level this week was the first attempt so this level which was not tested as a support it was tested it was tested as a resistance but not as a support zone so it was first attempt as a support zone and it it wicked below breaking this level so this was the first uh, point of you can say this was the first sign of the uh, of you of the price going down because it picked low it was the first time it rejected now what happened after next you see here price went down again closing below this level you see the price closed this the body of the candle is below this black line mean that price wants to go below this and now the price is going down making uh, you know break through this level okay and this this was second time it was tested i told you guys the swing low of this let me draw this as this zone as well okay this level was tested twice it was first tested here now it was tested second time now, now let's move on you see again you see the wicks below it making it longer wicks below side downside means that the price wants to go down so now again the price went down it was tested twice now let's see you see three in a row again the price went again first it tried to wick below this it went down here you see wick below went down wick below went down now it wick below this level which was not tested uh, this level now it was coming very soon now like next you see here on the upside you see this candle shows that this point this uh, this was a sport zone previously now the rejection from this level confirms that this level has now become uh, you can see a resistance level so let's see what happens next again a rejection from the downside okay this level was also not tested here you can see here okay this level was never retested here you can call see now next candle up uh, you can see the price wants to move up again move up it picked above good sign of uh, reversal from here again a rejection from this level means that it was tested uh, first time after the price going down you see here again the price going down again this level tested thrice you see three times in a row so this level was good but may also making it weaker as well if we go above if we go in the future you see here the price tried to break through this level but again the sell of volume was large and it went down again let me show you guys in the future you see here i told you guys this level was never tested see here let me draw this you see i told you guys this level was never tested and it was tested rejection from this level it was a good sign that at last this level has been tested now if we go out ahead in the future you see a rejection from this side means this this zone has now become a resistance zone rejection from this side means this has become a good resistance zone as well you see here the price again tested this zone now multiple rejections from the downside see the price became in a consolidation zone or ranging zone you call it again you see here again the price went down tried to blow try to break this sport zone okay try to break this sport zone but rejected again it it break through it went below through breakthrough and uh, below three below this level 
now this level would have become the new it which it was a support zone now it has become a resistance zone let's check the new new candle must be below this level you see i told you guys this new candle had to be below this candle because this candle uh, broke through this uh, support zone and now this support zone has become the resistance and this level you see this level was never tested but now it went uh, through on the 29th of uh, November and it again came back on the 2nd of February okay 2nd February this level was tested it it was required and it was due now let's move on again it again you see <laughs> you see how the price is behaving you see there you go three times i told you guys this these levels had to be tested and that's how things went on you see here these levels were tested and once these levels were tested the price had to move up let's take a look you see the price is now going up after testing these three levels you see that's what i am trying to tell you now also in the future this level is going to be tested as well but these were th why these were three main levels which had to be retested okay because this level was tested so which le a level which is tested uh, first time in the past it is tested only once in the future below that uh, it goes very below after a strong sell of volume in the future uh, right now there was not that much uh, volume it was the upward volume after the testing of three zones this zone was tested this zone was tested in the future this zone was tested and now the price had to move up you can see now if we move up see here let me let me play this these candles so we can have faster let's take a look here you see this level was tested again but rejected let's move on see here this level was tested again making it a strong resistance zone as well now let's go down move on in the future you see how the price went down 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 you see in the downside this how many times this zone has been tested making it a weaker zone so i suspect that the price may go below through below through this level in the future so you see again test rejection test rejection multiple rejections so this is a strong zone but also multiple rejections making it weaker so let's see the price had to go down again rejection making low a uh, new uh, low highs you see here rejection from the upside and you see you see multiple rejections multiple rejections many times you see here if we look at here multiple rejections from here multiple rejections from here multiple rejections you know price wanted to go down wanted to go down here and eventually it went through but if we look on the upside it all it only try to break once twice only one thrice here but here on the downside you see on the downside there are a lot of rejections one two three four five six making it a weaker so it confirms that whenever a level is tested multiple times it makes it weaker and that's here you are you have seen so the price went down and which was this level okay this level was never tested and here you can see here you can see in the future that it was tested and that's how the price went down again this level again was never tested and this level was tested here in the future this was required you see you see the price tested this level broke through the uh, lowest of the BTC level and after that the price went up because it was now the price after going to the lowest point now it remained in the you can say it was in the bull it was in the consolidation phase accumulation phase now the price is going to start 
to move upside and that's how things are now you can see now it was in the bullish move you see that's that's it making it a strong bullish move you see how the candles are now behaving after touching the bottom it was in the consolidation phase the downtrend was and that levels was tested multiple times after that the price went up you see that's how the market works see that's how the market works there you go 2020 and things like that now if we go back to the btt bit torrent here what you see let me tell you guys here what you see what do you see in the chart let me turn all the volume here you see this level was broken it was retested it tried to broke up again retested it tried again third time and it broke through it broke through and it tested the lower of swing high but it was never tested it was never tested at this level it broke through it was never tested at this level as well it broke through went down but it this level has not been tested so what i am looking here if we look at the price of bit torrent you can see here let me show you guys this candle has broke through this level 73045 this candle daily candle is looking for the downtrend because this level one two three four five six six times this level has been tested making it weaker so that's why the price wants to go through this level and it is healthy it is it is due it it has to test this level otherwise i can't you know that's not the way the market works if if you think that price gonna go up from this that's gonna be difficult because yeah you can say that a week below here if price gonna go down a week down there or a big week you know a huge a large week here below this point making it that this these levels have been tested that's how the price can go up but before that this price these levels had to be tested otherwise the price i don't think so otherwise the news or any hype can work for the bit torrent otherwise i'm what i am saying right now is that this level uh, might be might be this level is going to be tested again and we might see some retracement to this level okay this uh, the red zone here eighty three thousand. so i suggest you guys if you want to buy btt for the day trading not for the long term because if you want to hodl uh, for the long term you have to place orders maybe at this zone maybe at this zone maybe at this zones but for the short term trading you can place orders at this zone buy here sell here then again when the price came down buy here sell here buy here sell here but when it reaches the bottom then you can buy a huge amount and you can accumulate for the future and then you can get a large profit you know, 5x 10x 100x whatever it is but for now and also we have to look at the volume here the volume is very low as well this is also very important due to the low volume whenever the volume is getting low the downtrend is not supported you see that if but if a new candle a new candle goes below this level and the volume is strong from downside we can say the price wants to go down there are a lot of sellers but here if we look at this zone you see the only the one uh, zone only the one volume bar is above which was the good buying volume so you can see a lot of buyers are there but not a lot of sellers are there so this is also a good sign for the btt that price don't uh, doesn't want to go below this level or this there are not a lot of sellers here so the thing is what i think right now is that uh, if any volume if any candle or any volume bar which crosses above this ma level you see ma level this is the average level if any volume bar goes above 
this level and any red candle goes through breaking through this level and closes below this level then we are in the downtrend okay keep that in mind today this candle is very very important very important because if we close below this level any part of the or any part of this level closing below below this this level we will be we would be in the downtrend and we surely going to test this level and this level as well so be prepared for the downtrend in case if this candle closes below because you can see multiple times these levels have been tested the price wants to go down okay but there are buyers in the market as well but there is lot, not a lot of sellers here because the volume is low if the bars are above and the bars are green from here you can see then we can say the volume is going in the upside but right now there is an indecision this is this phase is called the consolidation phase you know this is the consolidation phase where uh, buyers want to sell but not a lot of sellers and i'll uh, sell not a lot of sellers a buyer want to buy and you can see here the volumes so just keep an eye on this level on this uh, candle and also let me cross check with some other indicators like uh, EMAs let me draw the EMAs as you can see here this EMA has been tested and uh, the price is in consolidation so we see this zone let me check which was the 150 we might so uh, we might gonna see this level gonna test in the future let me check with the RSI what the RSI is telling us what is going on you see here the price going down in here no sign of any you see no divergence here no bullish divergence here it is correlated with the chart and if we look at the macd let me let me check this as well this is also a good indicator it shows the uptrend in the daily base but in the four hour it is in the downtrend so let's cancel this as well let's take a look at the macd macd as well let's take a look at here you see the price is going down here as well on the daily chart if we cancel it as well now we let's take a look at us rsi stochastic stochastic rsi yeah stochastic rsi gives is giving us a buying signal here you can see the red line the blue line is about to cross the, but it all depends on the volume I told you guys keep an eye on this candle if it closes below we would be in downtrend if it closes above and any strong volume upside would make this level as a support level for now but in the future we are gonna test this when we when all the altcoins and the market would be in the downtrend but for now if we are in the bullish season when you are in the bullish season the these levels which were not tested these levels remain untested but when the market goes to the bearish cycle then those levels get retested that's how the market works so guys i think the video is very large for now it has become very extensively large so i just wanted to let you know guys how the market works this is a bit detailed video but just wanted to show you guys how the market works so that's it guys from my side our and out from crypto global 100 take care bye